Hello friends, this video on weather, climate and adaptations part 7 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. So that was about weather. So we learned that weather is about the atmospheric conditions which changes from day to day. Now the question is what is climate? Because for a lot of us we feel that weather and climate looks like synonyms but actually they are not. So when we talk about climate, it is about the weather which has been observed for a particular place over a long period of time. Maybe when you uh, actually study the weather for say 25 or 30 years for a particular place and then you arrive at a conclusion about the climate of that place. So climate is always a long term term. So when we use the word weather, we are talking about day-to-day -day changes in atmospheric conditions. When we are using the word climate, we are talking about the overall atmospheric conditions of that place based on our observations of large number of years. So climate can be defined as the average weather pattern over a long period of time. So when we say climate, it is something like this. Let us suppose if you talk about Jammu and Kashmir. So we say that Jammu and Kashmir has a cold climate. What does that mean? That doesn't mean that today the uh, weather in Jammu and Kashmir is cold. That doesn't mean that. When we say cold climate, that means that if you look at the average weather pattern of Jammu and Kashmir, for the, uh, then you would see that most of the time it is cold. Now, Similarly, if you say that generally Rajasthan has a hot and dry climate, the northeast states, so somewhere here, so these north states, they generally have humid or heavy rainfall. So they generally have heavy rainfall. So this is, this has a cold climate. These places generally they are dry. Again, if you talk about the coastal areas, so these are the coastal areas. So these coastal areas are generally humid. So all these uh, statements which involve climate, that means that the weather for these particular places have been observed for a huge number of years. For example, the weather pattern of Jammu and Kashmir for every day has been noticed for maybe 20 years or 25 years and then we have observed that more or less the weather, the climate in Jammu and Kashmir is cold. So how do we arrive at this conclusion on climate? So what is done actually is for every location, for example, Jammu and Kashmir, Rajasthan, Northeast states. So for every location, we prepare a chart for their weather. So to see how the weather changes from time to time. So for every month, like how was the weather during January? How was the weather during February, March and so on? So again, weather changes day to day. So even in January, you will observe the weather patterns of every day. So that's how you get an idea about the weather in January, weather in February, weather in March. And looking at the weather conditions of past several years, you say that the climate of this particular place is cold or it is dry or it has heavy rainfall. So climate can be decided based on the weather pattern of a particular place. So I am sure now the confusion between climate and weather is clear. So whenever you are talking about the atmospheric conditions of a particular day, it is weather. But when you are talking about uh, the overall weather pattern of a particular place, then it is climate. Thank you. Please visit www.examfear.com to watch more educational videos with a better experience. Please do not forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for latest updates. Thank you once again.